Hi all, I hope you're okay. This video today is going to show us how to half. What do I mean by half? When I'm halving something, I'm sharing it into two equal groups. If I had a pizza and I had to cut it in half, I'd have two pieces and they would be the same size. If I had an apple and I had to cut it in half, I'd have two groups and each would be the same. But what happens when I've got more than one item to share into two groups? I would use one at a time and I would place them into their group and I would keep going until I've used all my items up. I have successfully halved four items because each group has two items in each. Let's have a look at halving some numbers. The number we're going to look at today is number 10. So I don't lose track when I'm sharing. I'm going to draw 10 counters to start me off. Next, I need to share them equally into their two parts, into your two groups. I do this one at a time until they're all gone. So one at a time, I place into my groups and I keep going until all my items are in the two groups. I now need to count to make sure I have the same amount of counters in each group. One, two, three, four, five. I have five counters in the first group. One, two, three, four, five. And I have five counters in my second group. So I have successfully shared 10 counters equally in half. So half of 10 is 5. Another way to write it is 10 divided by 2 equals 5. Let's have a look at another number. So I've got the number 4 as my whole. I'm going to draw 4 counters so I don't lose track of how many I've shared. Again I share them one at a time into my parts until I've used all my counters up. Now I need to count to make sure that I have the same amount in each part. One, two, I have two in my first part. One, two, I have two in my second part. I have successfully halved the number four. So half of four is two. <clears throat> Or 4 divided by 2 is 2. Have a go at these. Successfully share them into two parts. Once you've done that, if you can write a little sentence underneath, half of whichever number you're on, upload them to Seesaw so your teacher can have a look. Good luck, guys.